Sup guys, how we doing? And welcome back to the channel, and welcome back, one and all, to another reaction video. Today we're focusing on a player that's actually become one of my favourites. Not because of his play on the field, but because of his demeanour, because of his attitude, and quite possibly because of his glasses. His name is Zadarius Smith. He's a linebacker for the Packers. I'm pretty sure he just snuck into the top 50 last year. This year, he's landed at number 51. And it's at this point that I think it's about time I at least try something. He's a Packers player, he's a player I enjoy. It's not Aaron Rodgers, but it is Zadarius Smith. So uh, just, just a second. Now, as I recall, this was a little tight the last time I tried to put it on. So what we're going to do is we're going to take out some of the internal padding. And we're going to give it another go. So I'm going to take my glasses off, pull on the ear holes, and wish me luck. Because <laughs> I'm going to need it. Actually, maybe I don't. It's amazing what you can do when you take out some padding. I'll tell you that much. Oh, she's tight. Oh, yes, I can feel her. She's getting real tight. Um, geez, what do you do? What do you do? I think you just got to crack on. I think you've just got to crack on. So we're going to go the full way. We're going to strap her up. And uh, give this man the respect he deserves. Right, guys, if you've sat through that, I'm pretty confident you can sit through this too. Before we get into the video, a quick word from our exclusive video sponsor. Ah! Major Key Physiques. What's up guys? Thank you first and foremost for clicking on this video. Secondly, it's brought to you by none other than Major Key Physiques. And I'm wearing some right now. Major Key Physiques is a New Zealand based bodybuilding and fitness brand. They have a complete range covering men's, women's and accessories. Everything is sized from small to triple XL. International shipping is always available. The products have all been designed with both aesthetics and quality at the forefront. With over a thousand happy customers and shipping worldwide, there's no reason why you shouldn't check them out. Head down into the description box below, check out the link www.majorkeyphysics.com. Use code JACOB20 for 20% off and come and join the team. Thanks for listening and enjoy the video. Peace out. Right, um, let's continue. So you met last year for the first time. Yeah, F48. Uh, <laughs> it's not. I guess it's Minnesota and the Bears and the Lions. I guess those are the guys who are voting. Sidari has had a big play in every game. Yes, he has. With sacks against the Vikings and Lions and the Bears. But you know, whatever floats, they vote. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I keep telling everybody, where else would you rather be right now? Y'all come in and just bring that energy. Turn me up. I need it to be louder. Give us some more. Yes, sir. Gang time. Come on, turn it up. They can't stop. But it took longer than he would have expected to really get his recognition and his time to, to be in the limelight and people to recognize the job he does. But now that he's had that opportunity in Green Bay, you see him doing things that you expected. Zedarius Smith decks the quarterback. I do not sleep on him. I know he's a top tier pass rusher. He go pass rush inside. He can pass rush outside. He got power. He got the speed. He gets after you. He's, he's nasty. He's gritty. Hey, girl, you better watch your when he turns it on, it, it's on. I'm trying to get to the top. I want to know the recipe of Defensive Player of the Year. The recipe. I want to know. Because I want that. Zadarius Smith has all the ingredients in order to become the top chef. A little shake and bake and a whole lot of stuffing. When we played the Saints, it came down. Uh, it was fourth quarter. And they did a read option. Quarterback kept the ball. I knocked the ball out of his hand, picked it up, ran back for like five yards. Oh my goodness, a Darius Smith! Sorry guys. <clears throat> I'm going to have to do something. I'm not proud of it. But unfortunately, my head is just as big as I remember. And look, this helmet is so beautiful, but so tight. 
It's going back on the wall. Tell you what. I'll tell you what. I'll make you a deal. All right? When we see Aaron Rodgers, I'll grab it back out. Decked him. Made the recovery. The biggest play of the game. And also, San Fran, where I came off the edge, strip sacked the quarterback, picked the ball up. Hey, man, what's up with the D-Train? Oh, the Falcons, yeah. But guard, I just saw how he sat back. And what he did wrong in that situation, I hope you watched this, he actually gave me his chest. So when you give a guy your chest and he put his hands in your chest, you can't do anything. Cedarius just steamrolled Chris Lindstrom, put him right on his back. And there was another one also. So this one, he tried to... Well, he offered his chest, but he had flat feet, right? So his feet were more so positioned like that rather than, you know, one back and one forward. So basically, not a leg to stand on. No pun intended. Overset me. I actually knew the protection again, and there wasn't nobody covering that A-gap. I feel like offensive linemen are supposed to know that when they go against me. Hopefully they know that this year. <laughs> <laughs> what I tried to do was knock the ball out of his hand. He caught it with his legs. But he still went down, so sack number two in that game for me. That was a good one. Phillip Rivers, he was getting ready to throw the ball, and I actually hit his arm. The ball actually tried to come out. It did come out. I think it came out. The Darius. No, that's just a normal Phillip Rivers throw, mate. <laughs> he just made the biggest play of this game. But the way he threw it, they called it. <laughs> yeah, that, that just looks like a standard Rivers throw, isn't it? <laughs> the incomplete pass. That was the game-winning play I felt like, and they basically took it from us. In those situations, to make big plays like that, I know I'm doing my job. If I continue to do that, man, great things are going to happen. Tell you what, guys. I'm not sure if it's the beard. I'm not sure if it's the glasses. But there's one thing I am sure of, and that is... He has an incredible smile. It's infectious. It makes me smile. His, I think it's the eyes, it's the smile, it's the beard, it's the, it's the, it's the stature, it's the, the fact that he's an NFL player. He can turn it on on the field just like the best of them. When they come off the field, they're a totally different guy. And that is something I genuinely uh, not only enjoy, but I, I, just, I just respect it. I just respect it. And look, I'd be doing you guys a disservice if I didn't look up his stats. I've done it before. I'll do it again. Just FYI, before we take off, 28 years of age, 6 foot 4, 272 pounds. Went from Kentucky into the draft to the Ravens with the 122nd pick, round number four of the 2015 draft. Spent four years at the Ravens, then he went to the Packers, and, and since he did that, it seems as if he's really come into his own with two Pro Bowl appearances in 2019 and 2020. He's not going to be the most mobile of linebackers, I'll admit, with a three-cone drill of 742 and a vertical jump of 29 inches. But with a 40-yard dash of 483 and a bench press effort of 23 reps, to me, it kind of evens it out somewhat. But look, anyways, guys, I have to be honest. Each and every player that makes it into the NFL, whether they be long snapper, kicker, or quarterback, they all deserve to be there. And they've all got their own Wikipedia page, which helps out a lot with this video series. Guys, if you have enjoyed this video, hit the like button. We're in the top 50, and that, my friends, is music to my ears. <sighs> See you in the next one, guys. And peace out.